Hello everybody, it's Lofa here. Welcome to the series on my YouTube channel. I've decided to start playing on the official Metin 2 servers, on the Ruby servers, which has uh, been created uh, two months ago. And um, the servers are full of events and it's a lot of fun, I have to tell you. So please sit back and enjoy. with I'm helping my friend with upgrading his armor and um, because he ran out of dragon scrolls we tried for plus seven but it didn't work as it always it fails and titanium dioxide for the current state of the server is extremely expensive so we decided to stop on plus six for now well hoping it will be enough for him He gave me away some of his uh, chests for the help and uh, just not for the armor but also for the helmets we have uh, been upgrading previously. Mm, I have the soul belt plus zero and I'm planning to upgrade it. Uh, from the moonlight event I've gathered some uh, dragon scrolls and uh, in my spare time I have uh, been making energy fragments. So I really hope it will be enough for plus 9 and it will not fail. Of course, for plus 4 it's for free, with the scrolls of war. Let's see how it goes. And plus seven, plus eight, no, plus seven, plus eight, plus nine, failed. And now it just fails. Successful, plus eight is successful, and plus nine, well, successful. There was a new Tenori event on the server, which I didn't get to enjoy too much. Uh, I was pretty much only farming while Moonlight event, uh, which is every week on Saturday on the server. And uh, here you can see what I've got from silver chests and golden chests. Um, it's pretty much just garbage. From golden chests it's quite better, because uh, I got teleportation ring and a pet for one month, which gives me 5% crit strike. And uh, I also got uh, the Antique Ruby, as you can see on the screen. I decided to purchase two more golden chests, um, because they dropped the shards that I need to get the hat for 30 days. And I had only five shards from golden chests, so here you can see me unpacking those golden chests and exchanging uh, seven shards for the 30 day hat costume, which is nice. Well, the Devil Wing Chakrams, this I could run about for hours and I would never stop doing that. I tried to upgrade it to plus 9 for over a month now. I failed multiple times, I've lost countless one for that. And uh, here we go, this is another attempt as you can see. I basically purchased all the Shuriken Plus from the market and uh, I'm trying to one more time, one last time, to get it to plus 9. And the results you can see on the screen. So the weapons are passing plus 6 and the plus 7 attempt which obviously failed. 
we ran out of uh, Shuriken Plus and we are not doing this weapon anymore. I will just wait for the Zodiac Daggers, I guess. Here is a guild overview that I have on the server. Um, the guild is uh, one of my main sources of income in, in the game right now. Uh, on the screen you see me reaching level 21 with the guild. And from now on I will be able to add uh, elements to the weapons for me and other players, I guess. Very, very nice. see me making a use of exorcism scrolls and concentrated readings that drop uh, on the server, which I purchased from other players, uh, to upgrade my uh, Aura of the Sword skill on my low level warrior. Here you see me reaching Grandmaster level and upgrading the skill a bit more. For some reason I really dislike how little armor looks like, so I purchased Zodiac uh, armor plus zero. And I've upgraded it to plus four, so I had uh, a bit uh, more shiny texture on it. And then I used it as my new appearance, and I think I really prefer this one. Now it's a time for the weapon. I previously had full moon sword uh, with 35% average and um, 8 intelligence. And I do not need intelligence on the warrior so I decided to sell it. There are some very very nice full moon swords on the market but they are extremely expensive and the uh, ones that are left on the other hand are weaker than what I had. So I decided to gamble. Uh, those changers are for free, they, ca they are coming from 40 level chests for the characters that are leveled for my guild, and uh, you can see the results on the screen. And I'm left with 38% and 20 undead. That's a nice one. After upgrading uh, weapon to plus 9, uh, it's time to add elements to it. My element of choice is fire because it's the best one against spiders for a moonlight event. I do hope to exceed 10% uh, of additional uh, damage against them and it's also very nice to have some additional attack value from uh, adding elements to weapon. Um, when element is plus 3 we get uh, to see the shiny effect on that. And I really, really, really would like to grind monsters with this style. I've decided to purchase this bracelet for auto hunting in Grotto. And I think it will do the job. Uh, it's uh, for the weaker characters that I will have to level up later on in the game. I want to upgrade Necklace with fire resistance to plus 9 so I can totally resign from costumes on the character. I think that plus 9 necklace will serve this purpose. Here I'm pending a plus 9 attempt uh, with a dragon scroll, which was successful. 
If you enjoyed the material that I have prepared, please consider leaving the mark below the video for me and I hope to see you next time.